Lebanon receives food support from European Union or EU and Germany. Their generous 30 million euros combined package will help alleviate the difficult situation in Lebanon brought about by economic and financial crises, the Covid pandemic and the 2020 Beirut port blast. The war in Ukraine is confounding existing difficulties and driving hunger among the Lebanese, who are now suffering from lack of daily food and fuel needs as their supplies of wheat and cooking oil from Ukraine and Russia dry up. According to the United Nations, around 2.2 million Lebanese people, 1.2 million Syrians, 208,000 Palestinians and 78,000 other refugees in Lebanon are in need of help to survive. The EU will send 20 million euros in humanitarian aid and German Development Minister Her Excellency Svenja Schulze promised 10 million euros to the World Food Programme Lebanon. The European Union is a recipient of four Shining World Leadership Awards for Humanitarianism, two Shining World Leadership Awards for Peace and the Shining World Leadership Award for Earth Protection, as well as a laureate of two Shining World Leadership Awards for Humanitarianism and Shining World Leadership Awards for Compassion, Unconditional World Care and True Caring. Germany is a Shining World Caring Leadership Award and Shining World Leadership Awards for Compassion and Wise Governance Laureate. Our appreciation, European Union and Germany, for helping Lebanon in this challenging time. May the situation improve as we soon have long-lasting peace and plenitude on our beautiful Earth in Allah's loving care. NASA records sounds of black hole. The U.S. National Aeronautics and Space Administration, or NASA, recently revealed the sounds of a black hole by recording the X-rays released from one in the Perseus Galaxy Cluster which is around 240 million light years from Earth, to convert the recording into sound waves that are audible to humans. The X-ray data was scaled up in pitch around 58 octaves, or 288 quadrillion times above their original frequency. The resulting audio was both complex and eerie, resembling what we would associate with millions of ghosts moaning at one time. Thank you, NASA, for helping to make known the sounds of a black hole. May all good souls be protected from the dark regions of the universe as we look inwardly to the light in prayers to God. Kenyan mobile app help highlight advantages of constructing green buildings. The Kenya Green Building Society, or KGBS, has created a mobile app called Jenga Green Library. The app will enable real estate professionals, developers, buyers, homeowners, as well as urban planners to better understand the entire supply chain of sustainable construction, building materials and services in the nation. It is hoped that this new digital platform will promote the uptake of green and recycled building materials by the Kenyan construction sector. In doing so, it would reduce the power consumption and energy-connected carbon dioxide emissions, helping the country reach its Paris Agreement goals. What a great way to offer such insights to your co-citizens, KGBS! In heaven's guiding wisdom, we sincerely pray that Kenya and the whole world quickly adopt more solutions, such as the vegan lifestyle, to hasten greenhouse emissions reductions. Research suggests higher level of antioxidants reduces risk of dementia. A study by Dr. May Baidun of the National Institutes of Health in the United States revealed that maintaining an antioxidant-rich diet can help boost one's brain health. More than 7,200 people were monitored for 16 years to determine whether they developed dementia. It was found that individuals with the highest amounts of lutein, zeaxanthin, and beta-cryptogenthin in their blood had a reduced probability of dementia compared to those with lower levels, with decreasing risks as the antioxidant levels increased. The key antioxidants lutein and zeaxanthin are found in green leafy veggies, including spinach and kale, while beta-cryptogenthin is present in orange pigmented fruits, such as papaya, persimmons, oranges, and tangerines. The study was recently published in the online issue of Neurology, the medical journal of the American Academy of Neurology. Thank you for the very informative report, Dr. May Baidun. May all people make a positive lifestyle change to the vegan diet for better health in celestial radiance. Caring men deliver reconditioned fire trucks to assist Ukraine. 
70-year-young Daniel Hannan from Cambridge, United Kingdom, is sending refurbished fire engines to help Ukrainian firefighters in Kharkiv amid a Russian invasion. Mr. Hannan bought three fire trucks out of his own pocket, overhauled them and had them inspected by qualified volunteer firefighters to ensure they functioned properly. Each vehicle has personal protection equipment, including helmets and boots, along with bottles to purify water. Together with his teammates, Simon and Richard, the trio traveled a week to deliver the first firefighting vehicle. Mr. Hannan shared that fire engines are vital as they can save lives and buildings during bombings. Our appreciation, Daniel Hannan, Simon and Richard, for your praiseworthy collaborative effort. May the affectionate people of Ukraine soon see happier and more peaceful days in divine grace. Students in Spain create award-winning innovative vegan food organized by professors from the Miguel Hernandez University of Elche. InnoBiotech is a contest in which biotechnology students develop food proposals for the future, focusing on health, safety, taste, sustainability, and social impact. Taking top prize at the contest was a vegan burger made with dates and abundant local food source. Second prize went to a vegan version of a Spanish croquette made from vitamin D-rich shiitake mushrooms. In third place was a vegan take on a traditional Spanish donut with anti-aging properties due to its high content of minerals and antioxidants. Furthermore, the contest highlighted the advantages of using products local to the small southeastern town of LJ, such as nuts, dates, and seasonal vegetables. Congratulations to all participants for your forward-thinking culinary creations. May humanity warmly welcome the ever-growing array of vegan foods in the guidance of the Providence. Team of Women Safeguards Wildlife People of Chinese Province Established in 2019, a group of six female guards strive to protect animal persons in the Northeast China Tiger and Leopard National Park in Heilongjiang Province. They work as hard as their male counterparts and are trained in expert ways of deterring illegal poaching and deforestation. The dedicated rangers spend up to 12 hours a day patrolling the forests, removing hunting snares, setting up and maintaining infrared cameras, providing extra food to supplement animal people's diets, and at times helping injured wild animal folk. These committed guardians have to study the behavior of fauna as well as learn how to track them using clues like paw prints and droppings. This helps them to defend the Amur leopard and Siberian tiger people and other resident wildlife. Well done, loving protectors, on your determination to provide a safe haven for our vulnerable fellow animal co-inhabitants. May the Buddha always guide you with safety and love through your daily patrols.